Hello and uh, welcome to continuing of our uh, inventory tutorial as part of uh, Mastering Godot book promotional tutorials. And in this uh, part we will learn how to use coding in code generator to name and uh, identify every element of our inventory system. Before that I have one announcement for every subscriber of Slavs May Games. Tutorial for inventory system as you're looking now uh, will be part of a paid tutorial in Udemy and uh, every subscriber of our channel can uh, use it for free as you use it here in uh, our uh, video portal to acquire this just uh, read description uh, below this video and uh, you will uh, receive a link for uh, free access to this course via your uh, email address. And uh, let me now continue with uh, today's short lecture. As you see, we have uh, some elements of our inventory. Every element have a number close to it. This number is number of elements, so 0, 1, 2, 3, etc, etc. And this is also done with naming. And when you use any of these elements, so when you click on first element or on second element, you will get respond about uh, your doing. In uh, our situation, this is button pressed. In other situation can be drag or uh, drag and drop, which can be useful for uh, changing place places of inventory elements. And uh, for this you need to know some coding, because uh, all of this uh, is uh, created with uh, generator for uh, for inventory system. This is explained in in previous uh, short uh, lecture. So now I will uh, go to coding and uh, you can see this part of code uh, which are um, explained previously and this part of code uh, create element for inventory. And uh, when you use set name method, you can give a name to any element. And because uh, we have a for loop in element creation, we just add uh, one uh, number here, so every element uh, have uh, name, button and some number to it. Number is increased and every element will have different number, so different name. Other uh, important thing is to use these names for creation of functions. In our situation, these functions are created with this connect method and functions respond on button down action. So when every button down is done in a script, we have uh, some uh, function created and function uh, use uh, names with name of element. So part of function name is 
element name. For example, button zero pressed will be name of one function when the button zero is pressed. To do this, uh, you need uh, to create uh, another for loop uh, from zero till the maximum number of elements in a loop. In um, to the maximum number of elements in um, in your inventory system, which are in our situation horizontal multiplied by vertical number of uh, elements minus one and after that we use get node and uh, for a name we use this name and uh, in the first uh, line here we just uh, set some text on our uh, button uh, node which are only number of uh, button and uh, when this is created you have numbers 0 1 2 3 4 5 etc 6 in uh, in a screen and uh, after that we use uh, connect uh, method here and as i explained it before we use button down action on our script which is defined by self as you know it and after that we have the name uh, created a name for the function so if you want uh, every function here to have response you will continue writing function button three pressed and in our situation we have only a printed output in output window this will uh, solve uh, one of uh, usual problems uh, which are um, which are um, maybe complex maybe simple simple for someone but uh, you can do it uh, for uh, better work with your inventory system which are code generator in situation where you create inventory system without coding so simple inventory with few fields you don't need to do this if you have two three four fields but if you have an inventory system with many fields, the I strongly suggest to use code generator as explained previously. And I will conclude this uh, short uh, lecture now. I wish you all the best and other lectures uh, you can follow about this uh, inventory tutorial on free for you on uh, tutorial on Udemy which are created in my profile and uh, all information about this you will find found down there in uh, in description of this video so have a good day enjoy life learn what you like to learn do what you like to do and see you goodbye